At gas prices still going up as the holiday weekend gets a lot closer. In fact, AAA thinks gas prices will be their highest for a Labor Day weekend in seven years. News 13's Manny Martinez live in Myrtle Beach right now with the reasons for that and reaction. Manny. Hey, Bob, maybe you've gotten used to the falling gas prices in the past month, like I did, making the increases this week a bit of a shock after prices in the Myrtle Beach area have gone up because of a combination of factors. Filling up, get ready to pay up. I haven't seen it this high, and I can't remember the last time I saw a 380 for premium. The average price of a gallon of regular unleaded in Myrtle Beach is $2.93, about eight cents higher than last week, according to AAA. The shutdown of parts of the Colonial Pipeline because of Hurricane Ida and the upcoming holiday weekend are to blame. And it's really just the perfect recipe, if you will, for prices to go up. Tiffany Wright says Myrtle Beach will see some of the higher prices across South Carolina. Throughout the Carolinas, our mountains, our beaches, that's where we're going to see the higher uh, prices at the pump ahead of the holiday because that's where people are going. That's why I'm getting gas today. At this Myrtle Beach gas station, the price of a gallon of gas has gone up 35 cents since Saturday to 309 a gallon. It's through the roof. What are you going to do? Uh, I suppose it's a lot better than having no gas like we had a few months ago. 309 is high, but if you consider the other places, I'm not going to complain about anything. The national average is 318 a gallon, and drivers say finding cheap gas will now take some more planning ahead. I think right now it's just paying attention, kind of being aware of your surroundings and, you know, just looking at things prior to traveling. It's the best that's probably the best way you can do it. And AAA says supply should not be an issue in the Carolinas, unlike other regions farther south. Coming up tonight at 6, hear from AAA about when we can expect prices to start to come back down. Live in Myrtle Beach, Manny Martinez, News 13.